We stand idle to situations that seem far away. If our own heartbeat doesn't miss, then we're preaching that ignorance is bliss. It is too easy to let history repeat. So let's instead reach out our hands and stop the humdrum beat. If we educate ourselves on what is truly happening, then we can work together, not as a nation, but as people from every location. Let's not waste another day. Letting others' lives fade away. Our time to pitch in is well overdue. So let's forget our weak past and let's start anew. If people are dying, and we know that mothers, brothers, and wives are crying, what has prevented us from practicing what our teachers preach? What has prevented us is what more than me has and will continue to beseech. Disaster and despair have plagued our generation, and many give up the fight due to sloth, ignorance, or well-deserved frustration. But acting as though the problem isn't the parent is only feeding the disease and leaving another child without a parent. It is hard to talk about, yes, and scary to make a reality. Still, we must face Ebola with a strong sense of morality. It is more than devastating to see this treated as a formality. Especially by friends and neighbors that make up our great society. So leave your complacency behind. And connect to the more than me state of mind. Join Katie. Join Bendu. Join Esther. Join Susan. Join Abigail. Join Rose. Join Elizabeth. Join Christine. Join Rosaline. Join Abrina. Join Felicia. Join Susanna. Join Mamaw. Join Agnes. Join Gift. Join Teresa. Join Angel. Join Grace. Join Angel. Join Join Angel. 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 Join Ang